good morning let's see how to do question number one in week one <coughs> using your AutoCAD software so I have already opened the AutoCAD software let me set the unit <coughs> what is already in millimeters so no need to change then specify the limits 0 comma 0 as the lower left corner upper right corner I'm setting it as uh, 500 comma 500 okay then zoom all <coughs> now we just construct a rectangle using a line command before that use ortho command to draw straight lines we need to enable ortho command so enable ortho mode and then use line <coughs> draw a line of length 100 then this one is 7 again 100 in this direction again another 7 okay next we have to define the style of our text so type style here you just select the font name ISO PE ISO CPEUR font style font name height of the text to be 7 with factor to be 0 0.7 then apply then close now type text <coughs> it is asking us to specify the start point just specify the start point it is asking the rotation angle it is 0 so type 0 and start right a b c d m n o p p u v w x y z okay then escape so it, if you want to come out of this text command just press enter once and then Q escape okay next we will try to do the same thing for a smaller case letter create another rectangle for a length of 100 by 5 okay now change the style okay then <coughs> change the text height to 5 with factor to 0.5 apply close now type text will ask you to specify the start point the angle is 0 you can just write a b c d f g h i That. Same thing we can do it for the lower case letters. Okay. Then if you want to write the numbers also, you can do the same procedure. <laughs> Try a line for a length of hundred seven hundred and then close the rectangle now again go to style as we have given uh, we have to sorry we have to change the height to so type 7 width factor is 0.7 then click ok close ok so just uh, type text <coughs> specify the start point then rotation angle is 0 then type the numbers Okay, if you want to give with the space also, you can try. Just practice it with the numbers and alphabets. Okay, then enter, then escape. Next, you can view the dimensions for all the <coughs> rectangle boxes we have created. Dimensioning is uh, very important. Kindly give dimensions. Don't forget. Okay. Suppose uh, if you want to um, save this file. Okay. So how to save this file? <laughs> In all the questions, it is recommended to write your registration number and your 
name okay so what you have to do now just type text in the bottom you can write your name okay so tvk and registration number something i am writing okay so i have written my registration number and my name okay now if i want to save this file just click this a symbol then click print okay then in this uh, printer option you select autocad pdf high quality then uh, select the paper size a4 sheet okay so you can see iso a4 this is a uh, 210 by 297 and then here you click windows what to plot you click window it will ask you to select the area which you would like to print so i am selecting this area then center the plot okay then click apply to layout then click ok then it will ask you to save the file you can save the file in your desktop Okay, once it is saved, you can just see how it looks. Okay, so this is how you have to save the file also. So, kindly do this first question and practice for saving the file also. Okay, thank you.